Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Mocktail Fridays. Yay, 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 yay. Okay, today's drink is called the Polar Bear Express. Why the Polar Bear Express? We'll get into that in just a moment. But before I continue on, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Thank you all for everyone who's already subscribed. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's get into it, shall we? And the ingredients we're gonna use to, for today's drink are some sweetened lime juice. Remember the juice that I was telling you about the last time we um, were making a drink? And this is cream of coconut. And we're gonna use a lime slice for garnish. And we're gonna use this limeade concentrated frozen mix for the drink as well. Not as much, we're not gonna put in there, but we wanna get a nice lime flavor. So that's why we're gonna use this. And we're gonna use this blue syrup, Curacao syrup for the color. This is gonna give us a nice blue color for our drink. And I won't be using my shaker today, but I do have it up here just for um, decoration purposes. And we're gonna also use my Ninja Mixer for this drink. This is why we won't need the shaker. And I love this gadget because it makes the best smoothies. And it also, this comes off in a smaller um, attachment attaches to it or it and turns it into a food processor. You can make soups, um, all kinds of sauces, dips, everything. That's why this is a great investment. I love my Ninja mixer. It's like, it's like one of my best friends. Anyway, Aww. so what I've already done, I just want to let you know, is I have my nice drinking glass that I'm going to put this drink in. I have it in the freezer and what I've done as you can see I went ahead and garnished the rim of the glass with honey. That's going to allow my coconut flakes to stick to the top. The reason I say this is a great holiday drink is because of the color. It's nice. It's a nice hint of blue which is reminiscent of the blue sky and the white around the rim of the glass is reminiscent of snow. So thus giving the name to Polar Bear Express. Uh, maybe cheesy, but that's what I like. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and get started. Now, if you don't have a mixer, that's perfectly fine. You can use regular ice. This does not have to be a frozen drink, but making it a frozen drink like this makes it a little more fun. It's kind of um, like a snowball-y texture, you know, snowball ice, that, that type of, texture but you don't have to use it you can get crushed ice and make the same drink but what we're going to do is want to use two cups of ice and let me get my two cups of ice and we're going to go ahead and get started in making this drink okay and i just got my glass out of out of the freezer and as you can see it makes a nice um frozen effect on the glass so we're going to sit this aside and i have the honey on top. That is what the um, coconut is going to adhere to to make it look like snow. So let's get started. I'm going to take this off. going to add my ice. And I had this ice in the freezer. And it kind of stuck to the sides of the measuring cup, but it's not completely stuck. Okay. This is just enough to make one drink. So, of course, you would have to use much more if you were making more than that. And now I'm opening my limeade concentrate. And it's a little thawed out because I had it sitting out. And I'm using six ounces of this, which is half. But that nice limeade flavor that we're looking for. 
Okay. And then into that, I'm going to add, remember these a little jigger. This is a half a shot. This is a shot. I'm going to do a half. Well, let's do a shot. Let's do a whole shot. And this is that blue Coruscant syrup. Okay. And pour. Oops. Doesn't matter if you go over a little bit. It'll be that much bluer. Okay. I'm gonna put that to the side. Okay. And then I'm going to add half half of a shot of the lime juice that's going to give it a little more lime flavor and I'm also going with this stuff this is the um, real gourmet cream of coconut you have to really shake it up because those coconut oils that are on the inside if it'll look kind of like oil instead of you want that white coconut cream so you make sure you shake it up well and I'm going to use I'm going to use two shots of this This way you'll get a hint of that coconut flavor along with the lime. Isn't that song? You put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> That's the song or not, but made me think about it. And then we're gonna go ahead and give it a nice mix. I'm gonna put the lid back on. Okay. And we're going to turn it on. And I'm going to select the frozen drink. Okay, now that's all done. And as you can see, some of the honey has dripped down in the glass, that's fine. It's just honey. I'm gonna take my, um, my glass and dip it around in the coconut. And I'm just dipping it in the coconut like that. This is our snow portion of the drink. See how pretty that looks? Okay, and now I'm going to take this off. Okay, I took the mixer part out of the, and I'm going to, it's kind of thick, so I'm going to guide it in. Isn't that a pretty blue? That is pretty. Okay, and now I'm going to varnish it. Got my little cutting board here and my lime all rinsed off. And I'm gonna cut it. Just cut a little lime slice or wedge, whichever one you wanna cut. And I'm going to cut a little slit in the line and put that on the side. And Ocean Spray sent me these little uh, decorative umbrellas. 
I probably a year or two ago, I did a post and they liked my post and shared my post and they sent me a little PR package. So thank you to Ocean Spray and on the little umbrellas, they have mocktails on it. And I'm gonna stick that in the lime. And I'm going to use my straw, my little Christmas straw. And we're gonna get a close up of this drink. Isn't it beautiful, guys? And guys, that's it. That's the Polar Bear Express. Now let's give it a taste. Mmm, it's so good. You taste the lime, and then you get that kick of the coconut. Delicious. Don't forget. Oh, this is so good. Hold on a moment. Mmm. Thank you guys for tuning in. And I hope you make this drink for the holidays. It's super, super good. Now, if you don't like too much lime flavor, you can dial back the lime, but I love it. It's perfect. And if you wanna amplify the coconut, you can, but it's perfect as is. And if you make this drink, please let me know in the comments. Let me know how you liked it. And as always, guys, thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, share, and like the video. I appreciate you. Have a good one. Toodles.